welcome back to another video we are starting it here on my morning walk because i wanted to get this in the shot the sunrise is insane when you're up here back there is the skyline you can't really see it now because of the trees i would never walked here before during the sunrise it's always like too cloudy during the winter from my balcony it's almost better because then you see the sun like over the uh tops of the buildings so we'll compare but yeah this is how we're uh, starting the video although today's video is not about walking or exercising or anything like that we're gonna talk about money it's not a lot of money but some of it Okay, well now, finally, we have all the working out out of the way. Uh, we've eaten breakfast and everything. I did four sets of push-ups. Um, you know, I set the camera up here and there and I do them from different angles. And the last set, I forgot to hit the on button. Now, I do work out the rest of my body as well, like at the gym. But I mentioned uh, in a previous video that I've had uh, shoulder issues. So pretty much the only chest exercise that I feel comfortable doing nowadays is push-ups. And the reason i don't really lock out and go all the way up is because i feel like it puts more tension on uh the actual pec i know there's going to be people saying like you're not locking out and doing a full push-up that's why i do it it feels better actually now we're going to get into the video here i promise but look at this we have a sunny day today at least the beginning of the day it's looking beautiful i love it none of that freaking dreary cloudy snowy rainy depressing as winter weather. I mean, it is winter, it's cold as hell outside, but at least it looks pretty. So if you follow the main channel, you know that I've done these type of videos before uh, in regards to ad revenue, um, certain videos, you know, how much my channel has made at certain points and so on. Uh, so I figured it would be kind of interesting to do it for the personal channel because uh, it's, it's a brand new channel pretty much. It's a small channel and it just got monetized in December. So we're gonna take a look at what I actually made from that channel in my first month. So the requirements on YouTube to be able to be monetized is a thousand subscribers and 4,000 watch hours in a year that is. So during 365 days. Now for me, since I have the main channel and I started this personal channel, there were a lot of people that came over to the personal channel like in the first day. So the subscriber count I had right away, but I didn't have the watch time. So that took a little while and I don't know, how many was it? Like nine, 10 videos that I had to make. And uh, in December, it finally got monetized. Again, this channel obviously doesn't garner as many views as my main channel, but I figured it would be kind of interesting for, for people to see because the subscriber count currently on this channel is 13,500, which I'm very grateful for, for sure. Um, it's grown quicker than I thought it was gonna grow. And I think most people who start a channel, it takes them you know, a while to even get to that point because um, it took me way, way, way longer to hit 13,000 subs on the main channel. I mean, it was, I don't know, two years or something like that. With this channel, it took a few months, but that's only because, again, the main channel, I have a following already. But as you guys can see, we're up to 16 videos. And getting monetized in the month of December is always nice because usually on YouTube, the month of December has the best ad rates because it is big holidays. And November as well, I, I should say, because big holidays there as well. We have Thanksgiving and you know, it's Black Friday and, and all that stuff. So, so advertisers pay uh, a lot more to advertise on YouTube. Now, the month of January or the months of January and February are like famine. Uh, usually the ad rates are cut in half. So let's say you made X amount in December, you'll make about half of that in January for pretty much the same amount of views. So right now, um, it's, it's usually not fun times to be a YouTuber. <laughs> but we're gonna take a look at the first month here. So we're just gonna fill my screen here. The first day 
was a dollar and eight cents and then 48 cents and then a dollar 30 27 cents 52 cents obviously here in the beginning I, I wasn't uploading a video then boom uploaded a video eighty nine dollars and eighty eight cents went up to 119 it goes back down to 28 bucks and then we had a pretty good day here, $196. Goes back down to 101, 164. So this is all dependent on how often you upload, obviously. If you don't, as you guys can see, it quickly dips. 38 bucks, $43, 149 bucks here, 78. We went down to 13 bucks here, up to 69 and then down to four dollars so like after the 24th Christmas Eve uh, ad rate starts dropping because it's after Christmas so all in all I made one thousand six hundred eighteen dollars and thirty cents in the month of December so my first month being monetized um, on YouTube sixteen hundred bucks which I can definitely not complain about but I also had videos that was kinda like I guess interesting to people where you know I have a new place to live I was showing the apartment and you know that kind of thing so just because I made 1600 bucks one month doesn't mean that oh I make 1600 bucks on this channel all the time now it doesn't and to show you guys that here uh, December 2023 we're gonna go to January of this month obviously we're only at January 11th by the way it's my sister's birthday so yeah I gotta call her <laughs> As you guys can see here, we've only uploaded two videos, 77 bucks, and then uh, it went down, eight bucks, 16 bucks, 113 dollars. We've made 325 bucks so far in the month of January. So, like I said earlier, it's going to be a lot harder to hit 1,600 bucks this month um, because it's going to take a lot of uploads. And also, as a YouTuber, you know. At least for me. I want to upload some kind of video that is, I, I think you guys would think is interesting. I'm not just going to sit there like, oh, i got to upload something, something so I can make money. Then you guys are going to be like, this content sucks ass. So a lot of people say like, oh, why don't you just upload more? Well, if I don't really have anything interesting to film, what am I going to upload? I'm not going to sit here and like fill my kitchen and talk about palm olive dishwashing soap. I'm exaggerating. You guys get the point. But that's just how it is. So, I mean... I want this channel to grow and it will grow. I don't know, you know, how long it's going to take for it to, to get to like 100,000 subs, but uh, I'm working on it and I'm happy that you guys so far seem to be enjoying the content. So if we look here on the videos that I've uploaded so far, they're actually getting pretty good views. So the last one here, 18,943, the one before that, 24,000, the one before that 17,000, the one before that 20,000, 24,900 and so on, 15,000 there. So, you know, for a channel that only has 13,500 subs, it's getting more views than it has subs, which is phenomenal. And uh, that is something that can be hard to, to maintain over, you know, the growth of the channel. My main channel has 760,000, I think, something like that, subs. If I get one video that gets 760,000, I've only had one video in like the past year that hit that number. I mean, that'd be great. If every video I made on that channel got that number, I'd be a millionaire. But we all know that that is not the case. Um, you know, normal for me on that channel is probably getting around like 50, 60,000 maybe views. I have a few that here and there that hit over 100,000, but. You know, just because you have a certain subscriber number doesn't mean that you're going to get a big amount of views. It's all about how engaged those subscribers are. YouTube is also weird in the way that, you know, you subscribe to a channel. Unless you click that bell icon right away, you, you won't even get notifications about new uploads on that channel. I think that's a stupid system. I think YouTube should always send notifications to people who are subscribed to your channel and if they after a while like man I don't care about this dude's videos just unsubscribe I'd rather have a lower subscriber count and have a higher average view count because that actually makes me more money and it's better for the algorithm I mean I'm just being honest and uh, that's just kinda how it works so in comparison currently for the personal channel it's actually getting pretty good views 
if you look at how many subs it has. So yeah, there it is. Uh, first little uh, ad revenue video for the personal channel here. Let me know what you guys think. We'll do some updates later on in the year or something like that. See if it goes up or if it's going down. Either way, I'm glad you guys are here. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments section below and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye-bye.